July 26, 2022, 11 p.m. to July 27, 2022 at 12 a.m. Okay. So in this hour, what was the uh, what were the results in terms of his physical activity sensor? Um, total sample counts were 14. He traveled 387.08 meters with the max speed of 1.5 miles per hour. And there, at 1152 p.m., it tracked that he took 358 steps. 1142 p.m., at, he took 74 steps. At 1122 p.m., he took 167 steps. At 11.07 p.m., he took 30 steps. Um, and then, sorry. Um, this is still on the 26th. At 11.52 p.m., he traveled 214 meters. 11.42 p.m., he traveled 47.74 meters. 11.22 p.m., he traveled 104.3 meters. 11.07 p.m., he traveled 20.99 meters. And then the speeds, um, 11.57, 1.32 miles per hour. 11.56, 1.30 miles per hour. 11.56 again, 0.94 miles per hour. 11.53, 1.48 miles per hour. 11.53 again, 1.50 miles per hour. And I want to direct you in, uh, up here to the, the top of that section that you were just reading about speed. Um, what is it calibrated in there? Miles per hour? Is that is that miles per hour or meters per second on speed? It could be meters per second. Yeah, that's right. Sorry. No, it's all right. And uh, so it, I know you just gave us those those speeds there in miles per hour. Yes. Are those appropriately reflected as meters per second? They are. Okay. So 1.32 miles per hour is actually 1.32 meters per second? Yes. I was getting it confused with how Google reads. That's okay. Uh, and then total energy burned uh, during that, uh, or, or at that time? 75.88. Is that, and those are in, I guess it says kilocalories? Yes. Okay. Let me take you to another time frame. And we'll just go up one, number seven, on this list. What time frame is, is uh, covered in number seven on this document? <clears throat> it is July 27th, 2020, or yes, 2022 at 12 a.m. till July 27th, 2022 at 1 a.m. All right. And what, what were the results uh, from th that time period? It took five samples. The distance traveled was 85.66 meters. At 12.38 a.m., he took 105 steps. 12.08 a.m., he took 24 steps. Distance traveled, 12.38 a.m., 70.22 meters. Yes, okay, sorry, 12.08 a.m., 15.44 meters, and energy burn was still 75.88. Okay. And then we're going to go to number six. You want me to go? Okay. Oh, yes, I'm sorry. Number six, what time frame is it covering? July 27, 2022 at 2 a.m. till July 27, 2022 at 3 a.m. Okay. And, uh, and as we scroll, what's the total distance covered, uh, tra traveled during that period of time? 586.08 meters. Okay. Now, down here, I'm going to scroll down to where it says steps. Can you talk to us about the steps that were taken? Yes. 2.58 a.m., 69 steps. 2.48 a.m., 393 steps. 2.38 a.m., 260 steps. 2.03 a.m., 182 steps. All right. The distance that's traveled at those, at those times. 2.58 a.m., 39.28. 2.48 a.m., 251.81. So we can be clear, are these in meters? Correct, meters. I apologize. 238, or 2.38 a.m., 172.81 meters. 2 a.m., or 2.03 a.m., 
122.18 meters. Um, here, as we're looking at the speed um, that's that's occurring here uh, at those at those times, from 2:11 in the morning to 2:58 in the morning on July 27th, uh, give us the the speeds at which he's traveling. 2:58 a.m. 1.12 meters per second. 2:54 a.m. 1.23 meters per second. 2:52 a.m. 1.28 meters per second. 246 or 246 a.m. 1.04 meters per second. 2:12 a.m. 1.14 meters per second. 2:11 a.m. 1.40 meters per second to 11 a.m. again, 1.18 meters per second. All right. And then uh, we've looked at the energy burn on the other ones. It seems to be the same, but the flights climbed. At 2.58 a.m., he climbed one flight of stairs. 2.45 a.m., he, tr he climbed three flights of stairs. And when it says, you know, flights climbed, is that... Does that indicate that he actually climbed a flight of stairs or change in elevation? It's usually a change in elevation. Okay. And then all right. um, that's all I wanted to go over on that particular document. The question I have is that based on the results of his physical activity sensor, throughout the night, and I think we, you documented from 10 a.m. through essentially 3 a.m., and then again from 9 a.m. in the morning to 10 a.m. Did it appear that the defendant remained in his vehicle, as he said, on the, high, on the side of Highway 316 or not? It didn't appear that he did. Um, it's actually inconsistent with him sitting in his vehicle. And, and if you're sitting in your vehicle and or driving your vehicle, uh, does, it, does your physical activity sensor track your the, the distance that's being traveled by your vehicle um, if you're in the vehicle? No. Okay. So those results are only generated if somebody's out of the vehicle walking around? Yes. Okay. And I want to show you States Exhibit 1.5. You've got it up there. It's already been admitted. Um, when you were looking through the defendant's phone, did you look for or find any photographs um, of interest in his phone? I found photographs of him um, looking at the media coverage of Susanna that had the pictures attached to them. All right. And Judge, may I publish yes. 1.5? Yes. All right. And explain to us, I'm going to zoom in here so we can see a little better, but explain to the jury what we're looking at here. Um, those are the timestamps that he um, he referenced or researched the pictures of Susanna. Right, starting with number one here, um, what are we looking at here? The date is February 12th, 2023 at 9.20 a.m. It is a picture that was released of Susanna. All right. Now, um, and I'll just go here so we can look at the photograph a little bit bigger. Here. How long before the defendant was interviewed was he researching this photograph or researching this news story containing this photograph? That was one day before he was arrested. Okay, so the day before y'all went and picked him up at his apartment complex and interviewed him, this was the activity on his phone? Yes, it was. Okay. Number two, what are we looking at here? There's no date documenting this. Um, it is another picture of Susanna. All right, and number three? There's no date documenting this one as well. It is the same pic, or it's another picture that was released to the media of Susanna. All right. In in terms of this one, I'll pull this up here so we can maybe get a bigger look at it here. No, I'm not sure it's bigger, but we'll zoom in. All right. What does this say on this one? Still no trace of Susanna Morales, Gwinnett County teen missing since July 2022. Okay. Number four. Uh, down here? It's a picture of Susanna that says, rest in peace. I can't read the bottom part. Um, it's dated February 8th, 2023. Okay. Um, when did 
We already have talked about that on February 6, her remains were located. But when did the Grand County Police Department, um, if you know, uh, make any public statements or reveal to the public that Susanna had been found? I know that Dr. Terry um, confirmed that it was her <clears throat> on the 7th, I believe, but I don't recall the date that it was released to the media. All right. Do you know if it was by February 8th, 2023? I believe it would, yeah, it would have been. Okay. Now, in this photograph here uh, that we're... Uh, well, obviously it was because it says rest in peace. Sorry. <laughs> no, that's all right. I, I, uh, I know it's been a long time. Um, the next one here, number five, what are we looking at here? It's another picture of Susanna. All right. Is there any date associated with this one? There's not. All right. And then number six? Another picture of Susanna. Okay. And number seven? Another picture of Susanna um, that says missing teen. Okay. Now, uh, those, do you know how the defendant's personal phone documented those photographs, how they ended up in his phone? From those, it was him visiting the websites. Okay, so looking at, at a website and the, the images on that website remained on his phone? Yes. Okay. <clears throat> did you do the same type of analysis with the defendant's work phone? I did. Okay, and... I'm going to show you State's Exhibits 2.1 and 2.2. Do you recognize those? Yes, I do. And what is contained in State's Exhibit 2.1? It is a search history of some um, searches that were located in his work phone. Right. And it is in the defendant's work phone? Yes, I do. 